In this video, we're going to learn how to use the isDecimal method in Python to check if a string consists of only decimal characters. So the decimal characters are the regular digits from zero to nine. So for example, if we have a string with the characters zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, this string contains only decimal characters. And so if we call the isDecimal method with this string, we expect the method to return true because the string contains only decimal characters. So here we're using the print function to output the return value of calling the isDecimal method with this string. So we'll save our program and try it out. And we do get true. Now if the string contains any non-decimal characters, the method is going to return false. So for example, if the string contained the period character, this will actually cause the method to return false. We can save a program and try it out, and we do get false. If the string contained a letter, this would also cause is decimal to return false. So we'll try a lowercase a character here. We'll save the program and try it out, and again, we'll get false. A space character will also cause the isDecimal method to return false. So for example, we could put a space character at the end of the string here, and then save the program, and try it out, and again, we'll get false. Now the characters from 0 to 9 are known as the Arabic numerals, and those are the most common numerals used around the world. But there are, of course, other types of numerals. So for example, these are the Bengali numerals from 0 to 9. If we save the program and run it, the method is also going to return true. So the method is going to work with all the decimal characters found in the different types of numerals that Unicode supports. Now the interpretation of what counts as a decimal is pretty restrictive. So for example, a superscript 2 character will not count as a decimal if we save the program and try it out, we actually get false here. Whereas the isDigit method is going to return true in this case. So here if we have isDigit instead of isDecimal and we save our program and try it out, now we'll actually get true. So compared to similar methods like isDigit or isNumeric, the isDecimal method is going to be useful when we want to know if a string contains only decimal characters. In other words, the characters from zero to nine. So this is how we can use the isDecimal string method in Python. Check out PortfolioCourses.com where we'll help you build a portfolio that will impress employers.